people have tragically died after a gunman opened fire at a hot yoga studio in Tallahassee, Florida Friday before killing himself. Tallahassee Police Chief Michael DeLeo explained in a news conference that a man, whose identity has not been revealed to the public, shot six people after barging into the studio located in a small shopping center. Get push notifications with news, articles, and more. Follow following Hooray. You'll get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notifications. Another man was pistol whipped as he bravely tried to tackle the shooter, the Tallahassee Democrat reports. The shooter then turned a gun on himself, according to the Associated Press. Kristen Jacobs, a Democratic politician who is a representative for Broward County, the same community in which a gunman opened fire at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida killing 17 students in February, witnessed the aftermath of the shooting at a nearby bar. A girl ran into the bar. She could hardly talk. She was hyperventilating. I heard her say shoot her. Two other women came in, and I kept hearing the word shooter, Jacobs told the Tallahassee Democrat. Jacobs also came across the pistol-whipped victim. Many people are alive because this guy rushed the shooter, Jacobs explained to the Tallahassee Democrat, adding that the man had a bloodied head. Authorities believe the shooter acted alone and are currently investigating all possible motives including whether it was a domestic dispute. We're all very saddened and shocked by the events that occurred, but it's important that people understand that there is no immediate threat outside of what has already occurred this evening, Delio told reporters. Following the horrific incident, Melissa Hutchinson, a resident of Tallahassee, told NBC Miami that she helped treat a profusely bleeding man who ran into a bar following the shooting. It was a shocking moment something happened like this, Hutchinson said after explaining that three other people from the yoga studio ran in seeking refuge. In wake of the devastating incident, Florida Governor candidate Andrew Gillum halted his campaign to direct his attention towards the shooting. I'm deeply appreciative of law enforcement's quick response to the shooting at the yoga facility in Tallahassee today. No act of gun violence is acceptable. I'm in close communication with law enforcement officials and will be returning to Tallahassee tonight," Gillum tweeted. Republican Governor Rick Scott also spoke on the shooting tweeting, I have been briefed by FDLE and local law enforcement regarding the shooting in Tallahassee. FDLE is on the scene and assisting local police. I will remain in constant communication with law enforcement. We have offered state assistance, Scott added. City Commissioner Scott Maddox, who was on the scene, wrote about the incident on Facebook. Left the scene. Have no words to express the sadness I felt. How do you make sense of a senseless act of evil? We must continue to talk to our children. Be kind to one another. Be civil always condemn those that spew hate. We can no longer ignore our hatred. We must act, and most of all we must pray," Maddox wrote. At this time the names of the victims have not been released, and it is not clear what kind of weapon the gunman had.